yo, 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 yo. What's up, what's up, what's up, na 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 na. Doing the Battle of the Beehive. Which is... Um... So some of these players I don't know, but it's a tournament ran by Dizzy. Um, and every game that you win, and you move on to, to play another player, and you get 20 bucks each time you win. So whoever wins this game gets 20 bucks, and then they play the next game versus someone else for 20 bucks. If they lose, the other player moves on plays the next player so it's kind of it's kind of a round table I think they go through the people twice so and I am pretty sure that one of these players is DeWalt who is a I want to say Protoss uh, low money player I think he's European and this this might be him. So you got Buell on the Terran. All the games are gonna be on the Korean map. Uh, guys, bear with me. I'm a little bit sick, so I will try to cough away from the mic. And Buell, in my opinion. Is the best, especially when they're he's playing for money. He uh, he loves his money, so he does not let anything get in his way of his money. Let's see if there's gonna be four gateways right here. So it'll be interesting to see just different players. Playing on fastest. So I'm going to go right into a command center. We'll see if he goes into a triple. Going to start attacking this SCV right here. People not seeing it at the moment. There we go. Running these guys on in. Going to go after some probes. Pretty good micro from this guy. You should go into a double gas. There's your forge. So we will see what red LML goes for. This is he's not really going to get anything done on this attack. A couple cannons up here. There's your cyber. Going to see the wall. So good he didn't go for the attack and waste those zealots. Factory coming down. Stem getting made. <coughs> so, not going to go for that third Nexus. We'll see if he goes for it a little bit later. Two more gas coming down. And so it's pick your race too, so... Buell chose Terran, and this guy chose Protoss. And if you pick your race, well, you have to pick your race, and that's the race you have to play with the whole time.
Couple cannons coming down. And moving these guys on out. Gonna get a probe kill. He's gonna. Looks like he was putting these guys here so he could try to snipe out a shuttle, but. He sees this and it's more of a mass. See if he puts on another bunker up here. And he's also going to get a turret, I'm sure. He's going to have 12 gateways. A little bit supply stuck. Going to see no robotics up here. He puts down even more gateways. Sending these guys on out. That upgrade should be done. I guess not. It's getting there. Tank drop. Seven minutes in. Scan coming down. This is going to get through. Not seeing it. And taking out all the probes. to get more cannons than that. Here's a wraith out here. See if he repairs this and then goes for another tank drop. He's got three factories now, putting down some more barracks. We'll see if he starts pumping out some observers. thing about Buell is he's just so <clears throat> clean with his Terran. Surprised he's not going to prepare this. Maybe he's going to put these guys on the hill first. And he's going to see he can go for a drop right back here. So not getting any other dropship. Science facility gonna come down. And he's pretty worried about the mass, but there's really a tank drop really did a lot. Here's your observer. This guy's got pretty good vision of the map. Another Nexus coming down. He should have got this a while ago. Observer. So Buell going to be maxed out. We'll see if he starts going for the attack. Putting down some more factories. A couple more command centers. Covert ops. No bunkers back here. Look at all these barracks right here.
Just completely building up his base. <coughs> Vessel. More dropships. He's got one one already. And that tank drop really slowed this guy down. Starting to get his mass back. See if he drops just the tanks right here. Has a couple ghosts. Guess he's worried about carriers already. Is there an observer in there? I didn't even see. What? I don't know what died. Something sounded. I wasn't looking. Here comes your attack. He's got upgrades on. He's got 1-1 one, one Reaver over here. And here's the dropships. And he's going to go straight for the base. Scan's coming down. Dropping the tanks. Siege coming down. Get some more probes. And here's some ghosts out here. And he's got a full base, so. I'll do some lockdown. More lockdown. That fuel is just so. Gosu. <coughs> That's seven dragoons that can't be used. Send these guys on out. Buell's just such a dog. Scan coming down. Max out. Here comes your drop over here. Not gonna have a chance. And there is the GG, so. 20 bucks for Buell. And he moves on to the next. We got a TBT. This might be. Uh, could be Dual. I don't know. Could be Terror, too. I, I'm not sure if he plays Terran or. So T V T. Protoss player gonna be bottom middle. We'll see how good his Terran is. We'll see what Buell does here. Is he gonna go for the mech build? I think the mech build is the best build. <coughs> In TBT. Gonna build the barracks over here. Here's your depot.
Yeah, so he's gonna go into a mech build. This guy's gonna go into a mech build too. This will be interesting to see. The thing is, Buell is a low money player, so. But so is this guy, I think. If this is terror. Factory coming down. Depot up here. Here comes your factory. Kind of spot out that SCV. A couple Marines over here. And second factory on the way. This guy gonna get in, so. Already lifted this up. Gonna see that second factory. And is he gonna kill the Marine? He does. And he's going in for the attack. Wants to kill another SCV. Vulture gonna pop out though. Can you get the last SCV. Good micro from both players. That guy's gonna go down. Here's your SCV right here. Marine coming on in. Gonna take out this SCV or try to. He is going to get it, so look at the SCV count, 19 to 15. Got this coming on over. He's got four factories. And not even going to go with speed or anything. Just two factories right here. This guy not spending his money as he should. I'm going to take these guys out real quick. And already going to be defensive. Going into Goliaths. Right into Goliaths. And he's gonna probably get this upgrade too. Vulture's coming on in. And I think this one might be over. Look at the supply lead. Trying to pull the SCVs here. These are probably Goliaths. Here's your tank. <coughs> Goliaths walking straight on in. Little Goliath micro. I think that's going to be your game. GG. Easy, easy win for Buell. Making it look easy. TBT, I think, is very tough to beat him. Game number three. He's going to be up against the one and only Hydra. So, Buell's won 40 bucks so far. There's 10 games, so there's a chance to win 200 bucks. So, both players are going to be tearing. Hydra doesn't really play this map, so it'll be interesting to see what he does. So he's going to go depot first, and then refinery. 
So both can be doing the same exact thing. Building the barracks over here. Barracks right here. So they will have... They'll be going for double factories. Here's your scout. So we'll see if he gets a nice... Looks like he is going to get a good scout off right here. There's your double factory. There's your double factory. And gonna be annoying and start attacking. And has the marine to help out. Pumping out a marine right here, a couple marines. Lifted this up so See if he tries to, if he's just gonna keep pumping out the Marines. There's your third factory. Let's see if he lifts this up now. Coming back in for a second scout. Depot coming down. see three factories no machine shop vultures are out three marines here's your starport gonna bring the barracks on over I think once he sees this barracks fly over he'll know he's bottom left gonna get a bunker up here so is he gonna go into a double machine shop yeah so pull this guy back so yeah, when he sees that bunker, he should probably go into his machine shops as well. There's your second gas. Another factory coming down. And starport for Buell. Two extra SCVs for Hydra here. And he's going to see this. Another gas coming down. And going to get Siege, going to go for a tank drop. So I'll send this on over. Double tanks, drop ship on the way. <coughs> Here's your Goliaths. It looks like, yeah, he's going to go into Goliaths here. We have to put those Goliaths down here to stop the drops. They get a Wraith as well. We'll see if he puts on a, a command center pretty soon. Tank right here. He's got Siege. These guys are going to Siege up. Might kill this guy. He's to pull this guy. Here's your tank drop. Dropping the tank in here. Gonna micro it back. And gonna use this hill. He's gonna run out of here. Both these players are just so good. Here's your tank drop. And this might sneak in here. It's actually gonna put these guys right here and use this. Here's your tank right here. More tanks and a wraith out here. This one's going in for the kill. Going after the SCVs. Siege it up. Not moving the SCVs. Gonna lose a few. Couple starports coming down. Another drop. Here's the Goliaths right here. And 
He's just pumping off of these two factories right here. He's getting cloaked rates as well. And supply 66 to 41. Comes another couple tanks. Not completely seeing it. There's the tanks. One's gonna go down. Second one. Gonna get some more SCVs. <coughs> gonna go with his own dropships, it looks like. And these cloaked rates, I I don't think there's gonna be anything to stop them. Engineering bay come down. Heard some more sieging. Put the SCV up here to repair these guys. What a G. Start building some turrets right here. Getting Goliath range. We're just slowly picking apart Hydra here. You have to lift this up. Here's your tank trap over here. This could do some damage. Good move from Hydra. And you got a turret here as well. Here comes your drop. Gonna bring the rates on over. And I don't think he's gonna see these guys. And not gonna be able to get that off. Very quick response time. <coughs> that was a good move though by Hydra. Take this out. Yeah, Hydra not really used to playing against this on this map. So Buell gonna be at sixty dollars. Gonna continue his run. He's three and zero. And we have Perucho. Let's see who this guy is. So, we'll see if this guy's any good. Obviously, we know Buell. He might be the GOAT right now. Just always kind of switching up. Looks like this guy might be going for a command center. Interesting choice in a TVT. Might build for Buell. I would say that's not the right choice, but we'll see. Scouting pretty quickly. Wants to try to do some damage early on. Pumping out the Marines. Double barracks right here. And going into a quick gas. Is he going to go into... I'm not really sure. This Marine going to get in here though. And might do some damage. This guy seems pretty good. SCV coming on in. Using his SCV, he's gonna pull this one back. Factory coming down, double factory for fuel. And he built a bunker up here, but this is gonna, he's gonna have to cancel this. Trying to save the SCV, he's gonna go down. 
Three SCV or two SCVs, three Marines. Take out this SCV. Pulling all these guys. We'll see if he tries to snipe this out. That guy's gonna go down. This guy's low HP. Another SCV. Gonna get that one as well. Lifted this up right into Vultures. Third factory on the way. But he's gonna have this bunker. Can he get that bunker off in time? Picking off the Marines. Takes out the SCV. the barracks double machine shop got two vultures up here try to run these guys past killing up another marine anything in here Vulture on Vulture action. Take out that SCV. It's your armory. <coughs> this guy's not bad though. He's got a pretty good turn. Been trying to finish this bunker the whole game and we'll see if Siege. He's got the command center. Look at Buell's got more SCVs. This guy went for the early on command center. That's that's what you have to do. Is you need to get kill more SCVs. Here's your two tanks rolling out. And just gonna be ultra aggressive, it looks like. We'll see if he gets the armory. Two more factories coming down. No starport. Gonna siege up. And no, there's gonna be Goliaths from Perucho. <coughs> those guys are smoked. Quick, after those guys are dead, he's already moving on in. Is Vulture gonna sneak in here? Start killing. Moving these guys on over. I don't think Buell sees this. Vulture are gonna pop out. This guy got six kills out of those two. These guys are in here going after the SCVs. Oh, that is bad. He's still sending them on in. Playing some mines in here as well. He's got this tank. Here's your armory. Get that machine shop now. Vulture's coming on through. Start laying the mines in here. Laying some more mines in here. Killing more SCVs. Down to 15 SCVs. Here's a wraith in here. Killing a turret. some more mines out here and these guys might get smoked let's watch this I think Goliaths might be able to spot these out and not get 
killed by mines. That's what it seemed like. Vultures, tanks, and a couple Goliaths. Starport coming down. Other command center. Get the upgrade. This guy's been playing at 300 APM. Lifting these guys on up. See if he... I don't think he has seeds yet. There we go. Throw some turrets on the side. Here comes your attack. Take it on the tank. And there is your GG. So, another $20 for the Buellster. SL Child here. Let's see who this guy is. See if this guy's any good. <coughs> and we'll see what Bill Buell goes for. So he knows he's up against a Protoss. Go with the barracks first. I feel like he plays different. A little bit different every game. One game he built the barracks first. Then the other game he built the depot gas first. And then the barracks. Then the one game he built the barracks out here. And we're going to see a rush, kind of, from SL Child. Here's your scout. Two, two barracks. And I'm going to start going for a... Cannon rush. Gonna spot this out. We'll see how good this guy's micro is. This might be DeWalt, who has a good Protoss, and he used to be the guy that would run it. There's your first cannon. Gonna get the bunker and gonna start forming the wall. Here's your Zealot. And he should be bringing that probe in there. See if he takes these guys out and attacks this cannon. Trying to micro this. Start attacking. Needs to take those guys out. That cannon's gonna come down. Cannon coming down. Let's see if maybe he repairs this SCV. Another cannon right here. Depot. Got a cyber on the way. Another pylon back here. This guy's gonna play at 400 APM. He wants the twenty dollars. <coughs> Maybe I will post this today. Let's see what is today. Yeah. I'll move this game.
Oh man. Sorry guys. So he defended that pretty nicely. Here's your Nexus coming out. We're gonna see Dragoons. And a robotics. Factory coming down. Stim getting made. See if he starts getting some medics. And engineering bay. There's your support bay. This guy's Protoss is pretty good. Starport coming down. And here are the Dragoons. As other people call them, Dragoons. Gonna build some pylons on the side, it looks like. Same supply, same amount of SCVs and probes. Get that reaver drop. I think range. That's yeah, done now. He's gonna let this. Bunker go. We'll see who just takes these guys out. Let those guys die. Here's your tank. Siege. Just about done. So good timing. A reaver drop. Here it is. Same supply for both these guys. A couple more gateways. Some cannons right here. This not the best place, but you probably want them right here. Going for the attack. Whoops. Using the reaver. Gonna have to pull back. If he uses a scan, he's got a drop ship. Two more barracks coming down. Just putting off the one factory. These guys look like they're going to build a couple more factories. All right. And some turrets. There's your tank drop. Wonder if he noticed it. More cannons, but these aren't far out enough. Uh, I guess that they will be. Yeah. So he's going to be okay. Three factories. Let's see if there's any upgrades. Zero, zero, one. Couple more gateways coming down, another Nexus. And not gonna get that drop off. This guy's Protoss is pretty decent though. See if he starts going into some Templar drops. Gonna start building some cannons. Sending these guys on out. Let's see he's trying to hide these guys.
Armory's coming down. Another factory. He's got a little bit more gas. Armors are taking a little while to make. I see these cannons over here as well. Guess not. Six barracks, three factories. And I'm gonna drop these guys on the hill. I can be able to take these guys out. This drop's gonna get spotted out. See if he starts making some raids. A couple of Templars. <coughs> More cannons coming down. This guy's playing at 370 APM. That is fast. Buell shows you, you you play at 190 and be the goat. I don't know if he's the goat, but he's the best player. I would compare them as... I feel like... Buell is like the Kobe Bryant, and Brain is... Michael Jordan. I mean, they're very, very close. I don't know. I mean, I feel like Buell is like even closer than Kobe is to to Michael. So maybe that's not a good comparison. Expo getting made. And Buell's just going to start probably moving on out. He's got a bunch of factories. This game's coming down. He's got these guys on the hill. Let's we'll see if he starts building some factories right here. One, two on his upgrades. This guy's maxed out. <coughs> wow, good storm. 12 kills. Another good storm. Very, very good storms right here. They get the ghosts again, so... Might be the new thing that he's been doing. There's your factories coming down. He's got these for drops. A lot of tanks right here. One one on the upgrades. Cannons coming down. Man, he's gonna have a lot of factories, so he's got these guys for drops. He's got these guys over here for drops.
these guys back. He doesn't have enough gateways. I think he needs to get more gateways. Can he get some carriers right here? He's an arbiter. And these ghosts will easily stop that. Another expo getting made. See if Buell starts moving on out. <coughs> Takes out that Reaver. And the one thing that Buell does nicely is he lays mines out. Even when he's playing at a lower APM, I don't know how he does it. But it's always hard to do. There's your lockdown. Let's see what's in here. Two Templars. Let's see when he brings these carriers over. This is actually going to get scanned. It's only three carriers, four. Tanks moving on up here. There's the Arb. Start sending these guys on and out. EMP coming down. Carriers have all their interceptors are pretty strong. Let's see if he starts sending out some ghosts. There they are. And they're cloaked up. <laughs> I don't even know how he's getting the. I don't know how you can even clip those. You guys can't even see the ghost right here. Let's see if he locks down these two as well. <coughs> this guy's not even shooting. Doesn't even feel like doing anything. There's your other lockdowns. Gonna get rid of some of the probes right here. Coming down. Carriers. Got some more lockdown, maybe. Not enough energy. Skin coming down. And gonna be dropping these guys on the hill. I don't know how he does all of this with just 185 clicks APM. Micros, he uses mines, he lockdowns, he puts units on the hill. And no GG from this guy. <laughs> so, Buell going to win another one. Who, who says another another one? Said uh, DJ Khaled. Another one. So that is game number five. Game number six against Silent Control. This guy, his name's Alex, I think. He's pretty good. He's actually beaten Buell before. So this one's going to be TVT. We'll see what this guy can actually go for a mech build. He's actually decent at it. Gonna get a late depot though. On nine. Very, very interesting.
So here's her scout. There's your factory coming down. Double factory for fuel. <coughs> Hopefully that's not going into the mic too much. I try to turn away. Double factory. So both these guys are gonna scout each other out. Good job here by Silent Control. Gonna attack that, but the Marines out. Marine out right here. Needs to continue to pump these guys. So I think Buell will get a couple Marines. Third factory. Buell's gonna probably try to be aggressive here. He's got the SCV coming. Position these guys. Maybe not. He's got the vultures on the way. Fourth factory. So just one marine forward silent control. Armory coming down. Goliaths are tough to stop. Do you have a second gas? Just one gas. Let's see if he gets another gas pretty soon. It's actually got pretty good mineral, so 330 gas, so doesn't look like he needs it. Machine shop coming down. Not going to get any machine shop. And should be able to take this out. He's got three vultures here. Another couple vultures. Might grow this guy back. Nice job. out the one vulture, another vulture coming in. And Goliaths, probably on the way. Two Goliaths. Looks like he should win this one. Maybe not, wow. This Marine is really doing a lot of work. Getting vulture speed. Here's the Goliaths coming on out. <coughs> Getting the upgrade right away. Getting some good shots off on these guys. And yet, vultures barely do any damage. To, uh... Barely do any damage to Goliaths. Mike rolling like crazy. Look at the... Yeah, SCV count, 28, 19. Another SCV going down, another SCV gonna go down. I repair this tank, another Goliath coming on in. Some of the Vulture on in. And just like that, buell has got another $20. I think Silent Control, if he wasn't so close, I, I feel like it, to beat Buell, you gotta be, can't be close to him. If you're right next door, it's like an automatic loss. So is that game number six? Yeah, so he's got $120 right now. Another TBT. So, Bay Agster? Bay Agster? We'll 
We'll switch it to green and red. Buell, bottom left. I had a feeling he was going to go for a command center first. This guy going for a mech build. Marines out. And he'll probably just get a bunch of bunkers up here. There's your academy coming down. That's going to throw this guy off guard. Not going to be up against a mech build. People going to see. He is up against a mech build. There's your factory coming down. So playing this one pretty standard. There's your bunker up here. Nothing happening right now. So he's going to see he is bottom left. <coughs> starport. Maybe he's going to go into a few starports and get rates. That'd be a pretty good move. Cloaked rates. Here's your vultures coming on through. Can maybe just run these guys on through. You got medics. Interesting. Lift one of these up. Two more marines. He's got a tank on the way. These guys are coming on in for the attack. And gonna see a lot of marines. So not gonna have a chance. Siege on the way. Tank is out. He's got an engineering bay. Lights are out. Gonna stim these guys up. And seeing that he has stim should be a sign that he went for a standard build. And he's gonna put down his triple command center scan coming down. Gonna see the four factories. SCV 30, 37, 38, 20, 29, 30. Another command center coming down. Yeah, four factories looking to get five. No starport just yet. Dropship coming down. <coughs> I like that SCVs when gas finishes, they start mining. They don't take any days off. Here's your starports coming down. So now he's got a triple command center. Looks like this was trying to this guy was gonna try to build a factory. Science facility, a couple more factories coming down. Scan up here, down here, he's going to see the Goliaths. Oh, he's going to go right in the corner. <laughs> OK, 
Come sneaking it in. Not seeing the drop right away. Kill some SCVs. Got 10. Another tank drop over here. Not sure if that got spotted out. We're going to build a turret right here. Here comes the tank drop. Who's going to just drop these guys right here? Dropships right here. Looks like this guy should get a bunch of turrets and defend. As best he can, and then go for the, a huge drop down here. I'll start sending these guys on out. He's got a couple tanks up here. Zero one on the upgrades. It's got a lot of factories. One hundred forty-five supply to one hundred one. Seize these guys up. Zero one upgrades for Bay. Gonna start laying some mines. <coughs> A vessel in here. He's gonna irradiate the minerals. Is he gonna be able to snipe this out? Looks like he is. Oh, it is gonna go down. Did he not see it? And he scanned it just to see if he killed all those guys, which he did. Go Sue. Here's your drop ships. You can put the tanks up here to defend. And then go for that tank drop. Gonna defensive matrix these guys. Drop on these tanks. This guy looks like he might go for the minerals. in the mines and there is your G G McGee <coughs> fuel another twenty dollars game number eight we're gonna see a TVZ I guess you can switch up your race because this guy was protest the first time So I wonder, maybe he went random. Maybe he's been picking random. We'll see, if Buell goes into two barracks and a gas, then it doesn't look like it. He's gonna go for the kind of wall. I haven't seen players put the factory right here to help with the wall. In a corner spot. None. Choke Zerg here. Mech build. There's your pool. And he's going to get the choke entry now, which is going to be kind of late here. Yeah, this is where you just build the bunker. This is gonna go down. It's already not looking good. So 
So then these guys then going after some drones. Takes out one. Start making that sunken. Gets another drone. GB starts attacking this. Gonna get these guys out of here. Cancel that. See if he goes right into just machine shop and siege. I think that's what he should go for. Going into a vulture. Maybe he's going to try to go for some attacking over here. But he won't be able to get anything done really with that. Let's in the sun up. Should probably get gas very, very soon. Another hatchery coming down. There's your machine shop. He can't, oh, he did. He, he's got one. Vulture gonna get this overlord. He just does everything. Right. There's your tank. I guess maybe he got the vulture in case he was up against quick zerglings. He had it for defensive purposes. This guy will probably make vultures. Yeah. There's your gas coming down. Another hatchery. I don't like the placement of this hatchery though. Keep pumping out the tanks. Gonna see no lair, so he's not up against any mutas. Gonna be able to take this out. Tank rolling on in. Be able to take this out as well. <coughs> right now this guy's siege up. Maybe pull an SCV. Repair this. He's gonna get the one tank. your armory. Goliath's on the way. Continue to make the vultures move these techs a little bit closer. These drones are very close to dying. Take out. Nope. Not gonna get that tank. So it's like another $20 in the bag for real. Guys did go down. Lights well, be coming on in. And there is your G G McGee. <coughs> I mean that's ZVT is almost impossible. We're gonna see Buell versus Hydra again. TVT. I think the only person that, that can beat him is... Nah, I mean, I think Silent Control could possibly beat him. So it's going to be bottom middle, left middle. We'll see what these guys go for. I'm going to build the barracks way out here. Hydra gonna go with the depot first, and the refinery, and the barracks. And 
And this is going to be making Marines. There's your barracks coming down. I'll start scouting. Got a depot over here. There's your refinery coming down. Pumping out the Marine. Yeah, gonna get sent to right middle. Factory's gonna start coming down. Here's your SCV coming on in. I'm gonna send that Marine on over. And he knows he built the barracks late because it's a double factory. Start attacking this. And I'll take out that Marine. Another Marine needs to come on the way. I have three Marines in here. Another Marine coming in. Guys getting owned. Pulling some more SCVs, trying to micro this guy back. He's just continuing to pump. There are more SCVs here. Just waiting for that vulture to pop out. There it is. <coughs> but now he only has one factory. Here's your vulture for Buell. Spot this out. This guy's gonna get sniped. Sniped. He's got four vultures now. No way he's gonna be able to out pump. There's your GG. So, Buell gonna win another one and gonna go into the 10th game. We'll see if this one is any different. He's looking for the full, the full win. This is against, I think, DeWalt. So, See if a mid build happens. I'm gonna go for that same build he did that first game. Depot first for Buell. See if he goes into the triple racks or if he goes into mech build. We go into a command center. So command center and nexus. Here's your forge. Here's your scout coming down. Gateway. Barracks coming down. I have a feeling he's going to float these guys in here. Cannon rush coming down. Is he going to get a cannon up here? Looks like he's trying to get a cyber. He's got the one gas. He 
He is gonna go with a cyber. No cannon up here just yet, so. Here comes a bunker. You get two bunkers. Other gateway coming down. Here's your SCV. Start sending these guys on out. Let's see if a Dragoon's on the way. One Dragoon on the way. Sees the double Nexus. Getting a bunker up here. Canceled that bunker. Academy coming down. There's your cannon right here. Your Dragoon range. Just has the one Dragoon on the way. And just gonna run these guys. There's a Dragoon right there. Let's see if he just runs these guys through. Try to get some probes. That's at least six probes, seven probes, and just going to leave an easy, easy win for Buell right there. Man, Buell gonna go 10 and 0. What a stud, picking Terran every game, playing against good players. So, gonna win the Battle of the Beehive 6, and I'll post this on Sunday. So, um, yeah, some good games. Give it a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. P to the C.